What's up guys, Chris Schwartz Edmondson here from Schwartz Edmondson Web Design. Squarespace just released a new feature update, so let's talk about it. So this new feature was recently added and it's a much better way to add background videos for multiple reasons. So historically, the only way to add background videos to sections in Squarespace would be you'd have to upload them to YouTube or Vimeo first, and then you would essentially link to your YouTube video and it would display as the background video. So it's annoying to have to do that workaround to do the upload first, but also a lot of times those videos were not playing on iOS on mobile. So they weren't playing on iPhones and only the mobile fallback image was displaying and people were like, why is this happening? Well, the reason it was happening is because the structure for the YouTube embed that Squarespace was using is not compatible with iOS. So basically they're just using an iframe to display the video in the background. In order for a video to autoplay and be muted, um, it needs to be in a video tag and it has to have these specific inline attributes in order to play on iOS and the iframe just wasn't compatible. So with this new method, we can now edit the section, go to background, but instead of doing the embed option, we can now have the option to upload a video file. So you can now upload your file. You don't have to first upload it to YouTube and do that whole workaround, which is great, but also the structure is now compatible with iPhone and Safari iOS. So if I right click on the section, I can toggle open all of these different containers and we can now see that the video is uploaded using a video tag and we have all of those inline attributes. So now if you use this method, you should see that your videos are playing on iOS, whereas before they might not have. Shout out to Squarespace, this is a great improvement and I recommend for everyone, use this method instead of the YouTube and Vimeo embed. Now, a couple things to be aware of, when you upload your video, make sure it's under 30 seconds. You can't upload a video that's over 60 seconds, but I say really keep your video below 30 seconds. Uh, that'll help cut down on the file size uh, and also keep your video under 20 megabytes. You don't want your video to be this huge file that the page has to load uh, and then it's just gonna chug and chug and chug to try and load. So check out the blog post attached to this video in the description below to see tips and tricks for how to keep your video under 20 megabytes. All right guys, that's it for me. I'll see you in the next one.